everybody welcome back to my channel in today's video I'm gonna teach you how to do a pigeon pose so generally moving into our pigeon pose we start from a downward facing dog so let's go ahead and come into our downward facing dog and just shake out the head and you can either extend the right leg up coming into a three-legged dog to move into pigeon or you can just bring that leg forward see whatever is more comfortable a lot of yogis like to extend because it gives them the momentum to bring it forward. And you're going to extend that left leg out long and just square off your right leg, kind of looking like a, a different shape L. Your leg is bent, flexing into the foot. You're going to feel your hips might want to rotate out. Try and keep them there. You can also take a block, a rolled up towel and sit it underneath your sit bone to square off the hips as much as you can. On an exhale, I'm going to slowly bring the arms down, either coming into forearms and softening the forehead down, or you can take it deeper by extending the arms out and soften the forehead down. So just see where you're at, see what feels good, and then keep being mindful of the hips. Don't allow them to sink to the back. And this is great for the inner and outer hips. On an inhale, we're going to slowly come up. Pressing into both palms to come out of pigeon pose, we're going to tuck the toes, stepping that right foot back to meet the left in a plank, and exhale into down dog. So let's work into the left side. We're going to extend that left leg if you like the momentum, bring it through, extending right leg out long, and just squaring off that left foot. Checking in with the hips. On an exhale, coming all the way down onto forearms, or you can extend the arms if you like. Soften that forehead down to the mat. Be mindful to keep the hips from rolling to the outside. And you can hold this for as long as you like. In a yin class, it might be held for a little longer. In a flow class, maybe three to five breaths. On an inhale, use the fingertips, slowly bring the body up. Pressing both hands into your mat, let's tuck the toes, finding our plank pose. And exhale, downward facing dog. Shake out the head, walking the feet towards the hands. Slowly bring the body all the way up. And that is your pigeon pose. Namaste.